Uh, welcome to Baltimore. Hope you had a good first practice out there. Um, just wondering, um, has uh, have you had been able to have any contact uh, with Lamar? Has he reached out to you at all? Um, and what do you feel in going from college to the NFL game? What's the biggest challenge you think to get acclimated to this level? Thanks. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so so far I haven't met Lamar yet. You know, I'm looking forward to that for sure. But um, you know, I think the biggest thing, at least for me, is uh, just the the different way we run. They run offense in the NFL. You know, obviously I come from Oklahoma State. We're a big, you know, tempo team. One word, you know, and go. So uh, it's definitely different from getting in a huddle, you know, hearing a play call and getting out there. But um, you know, I'm definitely excited to get in here and learn. Uh, uh, first day wasn't too bad. Went pretty good, but I definitely got a lot of learning to do. We'll go to Jonas Schaefer. Hey, Tyler, and welcome to Baltimore. Uh, I know at Oklahoma State you were primarily a right-sided receiver. Is that any kind of challenge just transitioning to the NFL, especially the Ravens, where they ask receivers to line up anywhere and everywhere? Yeah, uh, for a little, it's a little bit of a challenge for sure. Um, you know, obviously me, I didn't play obviously too much on the left side as well either. So uh, moving from, you know, obviously uh, outside receiver to inside receiver is a little bit of a challenge, but uh, nothing I don't think I can handle. So I just got a lot of work to do. Hi, Talon. That's Ryan Mink from Ravens Media. Just wondering, how do you go about learning the, the Ravens scheme playbook? How have you been doing that so far? Yeah, uh, so it's, uh, it's been pretty good so far, but for me, the hard part for me is uh, knowing when to actually put the book down. You know, I think uh, yesterday I was trying to get in there. You know, obviously I had I was really nervous. I wanted to make sure I knew what I was doing when I got out there. So, uh, you know, I'm trying my best to get in the playbook and learn as best I can, but uh, I think the hard part for me is knowing when to put it down for sure. Go to Garrett Downing. Hey, Tyler, can you just talk about uh, getting to know Rashad a little bit? And, you know, obviously you guys are coming in. You're going to be probably spending a lot of time together. Uh, can you just talk about getting to know each other in, in that dynamic? Yeah, uh, just over the past couple of days just talking to him. I mean, real good guy. You know, I think we're obviously building that bond a little closer every day. So, uh, you know, real good guy. I'm really looking forward to spending more time with him and getting to know him more. Luke Jones? Tyler, what's it like? Uh, being reunited with Justice Hill. You guys put up some big numbers uh, a few years back at Oklahoma State, and I, I guess what has he told you uh, about the Ravens that's really resonated with you? Yeah, you know, obviously it's a, a, a blessing to you know, obviously be back with a former teammate, especially a guy like Justice, you know, a real great guy, good friend as well. But, um, yeah, for me, you know, obviously he's saying nothing but great things, you know, great organization everything. I actually uh, talked to him uh, yesterday, I believe, asking him how, how his rookie mini camp went. So just getting a few tips from him and uh, knowing what to expect and everything like that. So looking forward to linking back up with him. Jeff Saribet. We talked to Dale, and he was saying about how he got goosebumps when he walked into the building. What was your emotion like, not just as you reported here, but – um, they sent out a picture of you signing your contract earlier. What kind of was going through your head as, as you took these two important steps? Yeah, like so so much was going through my mind. I mean, you know, you, you come back and you, you got to sometimes take a step back and look at where you're at. You know, this is what I've been working for really my whole life. So to, to really, it's really unreal to really even be in the position I'm in now. So, uh, you know, I, it, it's really hard to explain, but it's just, you know, Something I've been looking forward to my whole life, and I just can't believe that I'm actually here now. Cliff Brown? Yeah, yeah welcome to Baltimore, uh, Tyler. Uh, wanted to ask you, obviously in college, you were the best guy at making contested catches and played much bigger than your size. How confident are you that that will translate to the NFL level, and if so, why? Definitely. I, yeah, I have all the most confidence that I can definitely translate that to this next level. I think, like I was telling you, the biggest thing for me is uh, I got to know where I'm going and what I'm doing first before I can worry about all of that. So that's uh, the biggest challenge for me right now. So as long as I can get that down, then everything else will take care of itself. Gustavo Salazar? Yeah, Gustavo Salazar from uh, Raven Spanish Radio. Well, what are you hoping to show the coaches that they haven't seen yet in the scouting talk to you like what's the impression that you're trying to leave this weekend I think yeah the the biggest thing for me I, I think I want them to to show them that they can trust me obviously you know know that I'm gonna go out there give it my all and I'm gonna obviously do what I'm supposed to do on the field as well as off the field so as long as I can build that trust between my teammates and my coaches then I think that's that's all I need to do Jeff Saribet and you 
you may have gotten this when you after you were drafted, but there's been a couple people uh, compare you to Steve Smith, who obviously had a run with the Ravens, is a very popular guy in that building. Um, have you ever met Steve? What do you make of the comparisons? And is he somebody you'd like to talk to in the future, just to you know talk about his experiences? Yeah, uh, I've actually never met Steve, and you know, uh, you know, it means the most to me to be compared to to a receiver uh, like that, um, you know, with that caliber. But um, yeah, you know, I'd, I'd love to meet him. Obviously, get to know him a little bit, talk some ball and everything with him like that. But uh, you know, like I'm saying, for me, I think I, I need to take a few more steps before I can uh, really appreciate that um, comparison. We'll close it out here with Jonas Schaefer. It's Alan. Uh, obviously, a lot of buzz around in Baltimore when the Ravens hired Keith Williams as the pass game specialist. Have you gotten a chance to, to meet with him and do you have a sense for just how he kind of approaches how receivers, everyone on the team wants to run routes? Yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, for me, uh, talking with Coach Williams, I mean, he, he has that attitude, you know, that I, I really appreciate about him. You know, he, he expects the most from everybody, all the receivers. So um, going out there, he doesn't expect nothing less from you. Even just being out there from him today, you know, you could tell just his coaching style. I really appreciate it, and uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, getting coached by him even more. Jameson Hensley, did you have one more here? Yeah, thank you so much. Um, uh, Tylen, oh, I know you said you didn't uh, have yet to meet Lamar, but uh, ha, you know, have you thought about what it's going to be like to play with him? And is that a player that you know you've seen a lot? You, did you have you watched him a lot? Uh, you know, you know, being in college and watching the NFL. Yeah, you know, yeah, I, like I was saying, it's going to be you know a great experience, obviously, to play with him. Um, but yeah, you know, obviously, I I'm watching the NFL, you can't you know not watch the NFL, and not really know who he is at this point. So. Um, you know, just watching him and, uh, and appreciating the way he plays the game. I'm just, you know, looking forward to, to getting to know him a little better and obviously building that chemistry.